Grand Targhee is one of the most popular ski resorts in our area, and it's a place for family fun. But for one local athlete, that mountain helped her grow into one of the world's best mogul skiers. I hit the slopes to meet up with the Olympic hopeful who is keeping her family tradition of skiing alive. U.S. ski team member Jalen Koff ended last season as the number one female mogul skier in the nation, and her success all started in the small town of Alta, Wyoming. My Grand Targhee's home. Uh, my brother and I grew up skiing every part of this mountain. Now the 21-year-old has skied mountains all over the globe and has a very real chance of making it to the 2018 Winter Olympics in South Korea. It's a little surreal. Um, I mean, it's still hard to imagine that I could be there um, and I could be one of those people on TV that kids are watching and Oh, that's cool. I want to do that. Two years ago, she was named World Cup Rookie of the Year. In this past season, she took the World Cup circuit by storm. Jalen ended seventh overall in the World Cup rankings, won a World Cup race in Japan, and even finished the season with a bronze in the World Cup championships. Was able to prove to myself and my coaches and everyone that I was supposed to be there because um, there are limited spots for that event. But these races are nothing new to Jalen. Both of her parents were professional mogul skiers. Going out watching uh, my parents ski moguls and uh, thinking they were the coolest and I want to be that good. Now she is that good. And her mom Patty says that Jalen's raw passion for skiing is what makes her so successful. It's just the love of the sport. A couple years ago she was in Japan and she didn't have a great result. She goes, well I was disappointed but then I went out and skiing it was a powder everywhere and um, as a mom, that's what I want. We asked Jalen what would be the first thing she would do if she finds out she made it to the Olympics. Call my mom. <laughs> what are you going to tell her? <laughs> uh, I'm going to cry thinking about it. <laughs> I didn't realize this would be so emotional uh, that, that I made the Olympic team and then I did it. And Patty says that words can't explain what that phone call would mean. I'd probably just drop to my knees and <laughs> just, you know, thank you, God, and just, um, I, I can't even imagine. So <laughs> I'd cry like this. <laughs> yeah, I'd need a lot of these. She probably will need more tissues because with Jalen's work ethic, there's a high chance that there will be many more tears of joy for the Koff family. I want to be the best in the world, um, and I want to be at the top of the sport. Um, so... Yeah, in the long run, uh, I just want to keep kind of chipping away and making my way up to the top. Jalen's first Olympic qualifying World Cup race is this Saturday in Finland.